Did he? Did he? Um. Hello. <laughs> what is this? This little eyes. Oh, my webcam's still turned on. No, go away. Get out of here. Leave this place. Shh. Leave. Hello. I can never tell which one it is because I have 17 different. Face V? No. Video capture device? Nope. Face small. There we go. No webcam today. I'm lazy. I don't have webcam for Isaacs anyway. What is this? Is this Isaac in the year, in current year? 20, some, this July 2021? Afterbirth Plus? Not what? Non DLC edition? The after. Anti. I don't even know. What, what's the DLC? What the hell is the DLC called? I can't remember what the DLC is called. Who cares? I play this game like twice a month. Like twice a month? Like once every two months. Let's not do Isaac. What's the daily challenge today? To whom? Hmm. Eh. Hmm. Eh. 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 Who cares, dude? Is little emba- What the fuck is the warden? It's a little embarrassing that I still haven't done all of these post-it notes and I don't even have down the downloadable content. So the funny thing is, this is what happened. Yeah, I don't care, man. I'm having banter. I was like, I'll do Sky Skyrim, and then oh, it went. I've done too many of those in a row. Which I enjoy, like, dude, I don't get bored of the Skyrim. I'd be having a great time with the Skyrim, but sometimes I look at my channel and see, like, like four Skyrim episodes in a row, and I'm like, eh. Like, I, like I, I'm not, like, I, I, I love the Skyrim, and that's why that even happens in the first place. Um, But but it, it pains the v varietist in me. So what I was gonna do, I was like, new Fall Guys season drop, new Fall Guys season. Um, and then I went to do the update and Steam was doing that thing where it just doesn't do the update, you know? You know, like when you click on it and then it just like doesn't do anything at all. Uh, it'll download like 50 meg and then we'll just stop and do nothing. And then you're like, that's cool. And then you click uh, like the stop download button and then it just says stopping for like 10 minutes and, and doesn't, yeah, you know when you like try and download something on Steam it just doesn't do, it just doesn't down, yeah, that's fun. Um, but you know, I just feel like doing a little bit of talking. Oh, I have a, I have a Windows alert, a little eye. Rain coming, <gasps> good for rain. Not for real. That's actually fantastic news. I mean, it was supposed to rain all weekend, and then it didn't. But that's okay, because I was home and we did we walked the dog lots, uh, and now I'm back. So, no more dog to walk. So I'm chill with it raining now. If it wants to rain now, um, y'all can talk about that. I went home this weekend. I had a great bit for today. I was gonna talk about my fr fridge's warranty. <laughs> Little joke. I have mods turned on, apparently. I don't have a fridge. Upon use pushes, yeah, who cares? I mean, no, like, we have a fridge in the house, but it's not my fridge, so I don't know the details of its warranty. Speaking of Josh, though, um, sorry, that probably, c c context, Josh was talking about his fridge in an Isaac episode. When I say, when I start talking about a fridge and then say speaking of Josh, that could be taken the wrong way. I was not implying that Josh, there's a footballer called Harry Maguire, and everyone calls him fr fridge. He's a fridge. Or, or Slabhead. People call him Slabhead because he has a big rectangular head. Um, but people call him Fridge a lot. Um, so that's, you know, that's not the, the implication there. However, um, Josh started up a new Soul Link, friend of the channel, and Reese, Joshua, started up a new Soul Link with friend of the channel and Reese, uh, Tata. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, uh, it's like a Nuzlocke, which for anyone who doesn't know is like challenge run kind of. There's all a bunch of different types of them, egg lock, um, other other ones as well. <laughs> I don't know. There's from there's a bunch of them. I don't know. People kind of, you know, you get it. I've I've done one before myself. Um, it's just like challenge runs, and you can like mess around and do different rules and stuff. Um, but they have one. It's a, a soul link. So it's like a duo one, and then they both play the game, um, and then and then like their team members are like attached to the other person's team members, if that makes sense. So like, say they have a full six. Judas is liquor. Actually, I have no idea what this does. Why well, I have this mod on? I may as well have a look. What does this do? Reduces deal devil from two. Ooh, fancy. Um, so say they have like a full team of six, which they don't yet because it's, it's it's just started. So they have a full team of six, 
like each say you assign each one a number like one two three or five six like if if josh is you know number three got killed in a battle and then in a nuzlocke that means they're dead forever my mommy and daddy are dead forever yep dead forever um then Tata's number three, he would also have to then drop it into the box and it would be dead. And that's kind of like the soul link element, is that the, each each Pokemon on like their team is tied to a, 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 t a Pokemon on the other person's team. I'm explaining it really poorly, but it's a cool concept. Um, and what's... what's and, I, and I'm like, I'm looking... What the fuck is g this, dude? Bumbo. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to reroll just because I'm not going to read all of that. Spun. We love Spun. Um, not gonna lie, there may be, there may be itch potentiality there. Now, I've had Pokemon on the back burner for a long time, and Josh can attest to this, actually, because I DM'd Josh, like, actually, like, a year ago now, maybe longer, and was like, hey, what's Nuzlocke? What's the deal with that? How does, should I, what, how does one do one of those? Um... And he told me about it, and he may remember that conversation. It's been on the back, and then I just never got around to it. It's been on the back burner basically since then. Um, now, for anyone who doesn't know, I've done Pokemon stuff before. Uh, well, obviously, like, kind of general content, one-off videos, etc., etc. I did some Sun and Moon news content back in the day. Um, but I did a Let's Play of, uh, of Red, I did a Let's Play of Silver, I did a Let's Play of Pearl that I didn't finish. And yet for some reason is like my most popular series of all time, like every video has like the lowest viewed video in the 22 part series has like 3,000 views. And like the first episode has like 20 something thousand. I don't know why or like what happened to that. And like if you search Let's Play po Pokemon Pearl it's like the third result or something stupid. I don't know what, I don't know, I don't know why, I didn't even finish the series. Um, and then I did a ROM hack that was Pokemon Blaze Black 2, and I did like a pseudo Nuzlocke type thing, where it was kind of winging it, it was a me type challenge series where I was kind of like, here are some rules, I kind of just thought of off the top of my head, um, although I did actually stick to those rules, believe it or not. Uh, I was thinking to do one for Rubus, because I, I, I was a one through, I was a gen one through four boy. And um, Ruby is definitely the one I, I played the. It's still have positive memories of and enjoyed, but played the least, and therefore have the the kind of the least memory of. Gen one doesn't even like matter. Like I would just zoom through it. My let's play of Red was eight episodes long. It, like I'll just zoom through it, you know. Um, and then Silver, like we, we we did the whole thing, you know. I guess I could finish Pearl, but like I'll do Platinum or something. But I kind of want to do Ruby because I never did a, a series on that. Um. So I don't know. That could be fun. I, I'm not. I'm not doing it just yet because we have uh, Skyrim going on and, and Fall Guys is kind of still going on. Um, so we'll 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 see. Like I kind of I, I like the idea of having. I don't mind having two series at once. But I like the idea of having something like Skyrim that's like the ongoing thing and we'll have like a start point and an end point at some point. And then I like if I'm gonna have a second series, I like having something like Fall Guys where it's like. You know, every episode's individual, and I could just, like, end the series at any point and move on to something else. Um, so, it, I, I don't know how well I'd balance the variety with having, like, two series on the go at the same time that are both, like, you know, like a, a playthrough type thing. Um, so, I don't know if that's, like, super mega on the horizon, but all I'm saying is the seed... The seed was planted, like, a year ago. Um... Josh and Josh and uh, and Tata are, are maybe water in that sleed sleed seed ever so slightly right now. That's all I'm saying. They do be squirting right now. They do be squirting. If I was a plant and someone squirted me with water, I would probably moan a little. <laughs> you see that one? Yeah, see that one. Um. Okay, let's just like vibe it. Let's just vibe it, dude. I'm just like vibing. I'm not even like. I don't have much damage, but the thing is, what's damage in this world? You know what I mean? If one number's down, another another number's always going to be up. Right, gamers? Right, investors? That's what they say, right? It's all a seesaw. Investing is a seesaw. Oh, no. My, um... Um... My, um... Airbus stocks are a little low today. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
But that's okay, because Greg's is is rocking. Greg's did not rock. If, it's funny. Um. Nah, you know, never mind. We don't need to talk about. Okay, can I? Can I just like? I. I don't have the energy to be for sure. I just walked. I did hundred percent devil deal, and I just walked into him, dude. I just walked into him. <sighs> Did I not even camping at the end of next month for like four days? That's really exciting. I used to go camping a lot as a kid, like a lot, a lot with my family. Um, we had a camper van, a, a Volkswagen um, Deluxe 67, uh, black on the bottom, cream on the top. And um, we'd go camping in it a lot. We'd go to a lot of like uh, VW shows and stuff, uh, and then some more just like chill ones. And and we eventually sold. We had a Beetle as well, a classic Beetle. We eventually sold both the Beetle and the camper, and then we had a square back. And then that one, I think we were gonna sell eventually, but then my family were in a, a, a pretty rough car crash, um, and and the, the the thing got like crushed like a tin can, uh, and was was written off. Uh, which was unfortunate, but considering just how badly that thing got toasted, I do not give a fuck less because I'm just grateful that no one in my family uh, was killed, to be honest. So, you know, um, but that, that, that so that one that one suffered a, a tough fate. And then we haven't had any like classic cars or VW since that. Um, we used to go camping a lot, so I kind of grew up. I love the I love outdoorsy stuff. I love being in nature. Um, obviously I loved horse riding growing up and, and can still ride a horse and I like, you know, going on hikes and shit. I'm really jealous because uh, Maria's been in Colorado. Um, uh, another good friend of the channel and also Reese. Um, this is- oh baby! Good friend of the channel slash Reese Day. Um, Maria has been in Colorado, and I'd be seeing, um, and, and Colorado already is a state that I want to visit, uh, obviously no, I've never been, but I, I like the idea of it at least, it looks like, a lot of it looks super pretty, um, but have you seen her stories and stuff? <laughs> little jealous, not gonna lie, little jealous, a little jealous, hey, frig you, buddy, very jealous, I've been extremely jealous, um, so I, you know, I like hikes and shit, I like outdoors. I've always said I, I, I really like archery, and I've said this before. Um, I really like archery. That's why you know when I started playing Genshin, that's why I um, I chose to main Amber. Uh, that that's the reason is because I really like archery. Uh, which side note, um, I'm gonna end up with too many archers. I'm getting Yo Yoimiya in like two weeks when she drops, guaranteed, hundred percent satisfaction, guaranteed, hundred percent of the time. Um. And then I um, I want Sarah because I have fallen in love with Pixels again, um, who is also an archer, which I didn't know until like a week ago. I'm gonna have too many archers, but also I don't care because it's my favorite. Yeah. Um, yeah. So and I remember as a kid going up into the hills and doing like archery and shit. Oh, I just love being outside climbing. Climbing's a bit random, actually. I don't remember the last time I climbed, but I'll go, dude, I'll go climbing. Hell yeah. Get stuck between a rock like James Franco and drink my own pee. I drink my pee, to be honest. I don't know if you guys have seen 127 hours. He kind of hesitates. Well, not really. The hesitation is more in the whole, like, cutting his own limb off. Um, that's understandable. Dude, that movie's crazy. Yeah, he, he cut his arm off, man. You guys ever think about that? Um, what was I saying? Which came first, 127 hours or saw five, four? F a pound of flesh is five, right? The one where they have to sacrifice more flesh into the weight thing, and the dude starts like the big, big, big lad starts like cutting off chunks of his like stomach. Um. And then she's like, I can't do that because he's like a large man and I'm skinny lady. So she chops her her whole arm off. Um, 127 hours, crazy movie, crazy movie. You guys see the part in 127 hours when Jigsaw says whoever cuts the most flesh off wins. So like the large man starts to cut off like chunks of his body. 
and then um, James Franco can't compete because he's not he doesn't have as much body mass so he cuts his arm off yeah I don't know I'm workshopping that bit um, so here's the thing I like being outdoors so I'm excited because I haven't been camping in a long time and it'll be nice because it'll be a few days and I'm like yo maybe it'll be nice to just like not even okay I'll probably take my phone in case like an emergency happens um, like uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre but my thinking is I may just like turn my phone off for like five days would that be crazy is that crazy talk I may do a Justin Vernon and like just turn all uh, turn off all my digitals and write an album about I haven't been through a breakup recently though so I don't really have anything to I couldn't really do like a, a forever forever ago I could I could um what can I write about that's what, like what's going on right now not a great deal to be honest I could like I could a song oof if I were to write a song right now a song a musical or oh, a, a piece of music with like lyrics and stuff that I would sing yeah no I got nothing tbh I got nothing tbh um but yeah so that should be fun we're taking the dog and I'm gonna sleep with the dog so that should be fun uh reduces devil deal no nope. Camouflage is the player randomly. Eh, that's I'm like I'm chill. I'm chill with it. I'm like I don't know, I don't know if I'm rocking with that one. I um I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be vibing with the dog and like like my family and stuff. And apparently there's gonna be lots of alcohol there, which is good. And then there's like uh, food trucks with like pizza and halloumi, like salads and shit. I don't know, man. I, I, they said alcohol and I was in. Very much in. Very, very much in. Oh, I had a um, tiki... I had tiki Captain Morgan on the weekend. Uh, which is like, it's Captain Morgan and it's it was mango and pineapple flavour. That shit is actually lethal. Because it tastes like fruit. It tastes like fruit. Like you put it in... I was just mixing it with lemonade and it tasted just like a, a, like a tropical soda. It was fruit, dude. There's no alcohol in there. There was alcohol in there. Um, no keys. But there was no alcohol in, alcohol in there. But, I mean, but there was though. Um, so I might just take an entire bottle of that and drink it in one night and then uh, send drunk text messages that I regret. I'm not doing that anymore, actually. Um, I don't do that anymore. Kind of. Probably. Maybe. Dude, I've been doing good, that's all I'm saying. I don't need to dwell on what that means, if you know, you know. But I've been doing good. Like, look, I've looked, all I'm saying is past like week and a half since I said I was gonna... Like, I've been doing good. That's all I'm saying. Anyway, I have no bits. I'm so like out of... I keep saying this every time I record over the past couple of weeks, but I'm so like out of it that even like if I think of a bit, I don't even think to like lock it away mentally to talk about because I just have no like... I'm just not in YouTuber mindset right now. I'm just not in hashtag rise and grind YouTuber mindset. I'm just not in YouTuber mindset. I have like nothing going on in, in the YouTube space. I'm probably at like an all time low in terms of my comment tree. Comment tree tree Terry to commentary comment commentary ability. I mean, it's not like it's not like bad, you know. Like I'm 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 Hopefully next week we can get back to normal a little bit. Dude, everything is just stinky. Everything smells bad. I can't, like, we'll get a key maybe. I don't know, who cares? Is there anything exciting going on in news that I can talk about? What's trending on Twitter right now? I don't understand cat girls. I know I'm supposed to. But I, I'm just going to be honest. Here. Robert Pattinson's trending. Oh no, it w disappeared. What do you do? Is he dead? That'd be sad. That would be sad. I think, like, actually nothing. People are just, like, talking about him, I guess. People are just talking about him.
Rolls Royce. Bro okay. I just like Olympic stuff. Did you get, what's everyone's favorite Olympic sport? Do I, I like the Olympics. The Olympics are fun. Um, it's part of why I just bend me over. I didn't. What, I don't know why that came out. <laughs> um, you didn't hear that. It was a glitch. I was hacked. I was hacked. Oh no! I got hacked. And still, one of the funniest things of all time is uh, the funniest Twitter moments of all time was when Rita Ora was like. 100,000 retweets, and I'll uh, drop some new music, and then it got like, like, it w what, it was like a thousand or something, or like not even a thousand, and then she was like, ah, now nah, I got hacked, people are threatening to release my music, it will come out when it's ready, angry face, you know, anyway, um, I didn't say what you thought, I just said, <laughs> what was I saying? Uh, the Olympics are fun, and I, uh, and we do this, um, Tradition at home, and that's why part of what I went home for. Um, actually, that wasn't. We had a thing on Saturday, is what I actually went home for. Um, oh, that reminds me. You know, what I say I've been doing good, but I will say I watched back the VOD of Josh's stream on Saturday because I missed the first half of it. Um, and the second half of it, I. Interesting. Was uh, UTI for? Which apparently doesn't mean under the influence. Um, the more you know, the more you know. That was a fun conversation. Oh, look, all I'm saying is I've genuinely been saying UTI as under the influence for years, and not a single person has ever, like, flagged that up until the other day. My friend was like, um, she told me a joke and I didn't get it, and I said, tell me tomorrow. And then she told me again the next day, and I was like, okay, I was a little UTI last night but I'm sober now and I still don't get it and then she was like what do you mean you you were a little you you t like what 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 is that what do you mean and I was like what do you mean what do I mean I was under the influence and she said google UTI for me and I googled it and I went oh no that's a piss thing <laughs> um anyway that was a side note and just a little side note for you yeet I um forgot what I was saying you win some, you lose some. What the fuck was I saying? Uh, we do uh, international buffet, and we get all sorts of like uh, tidbits from different countries, uh, like sushi and you know, fucking like kofta and stuff like that. I don't know. Um, different cheeses and shit. We do a buffet with like a bunch of different international dishes, and then we draw flags. We draw flags. Uh, and I drew the United States of America to try and redeem myself for when I drew it in Gartic Phone a couple of weeks ago and couldn't remember what the colours were. And I drew... Um, we're at max tier right already, and I took a tears up. I am um, silly. Silly. I am... Um, drew the United States of America flag. Also because, obviously, because I'm a simp for that country and the people that live in it. And by the people I live in it, I mean, like, some of the people I li that live in it. A lot of them, to be honest... This may be controversial. A lot of them, I could, I could take or leave. Just gonna say it. A good chunk of them, I could take or leave. Um, however, any a, a good, a, a good chunk of them, I'm, I'm rocking with. Um, and uh, a, 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 a decent handful of them, I would uh, die for. So, you know, poggy. Take a little poggy for, for, the, for that one. Um, especially like uh, friends, and then also like. Um, the, 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 the pr pretty, pretty girls with Midwestern or, like, Southern accents. Those ones are, that, you know, those ones are pretty, like, I'm chilling with them. Like, you know, I'm not, like, I'm making a big deal out of it, but I'm rocking with those ones, too. Um, you know when Captain Crows wrote the song, American Girls, and then they said that, that they were, like, good or whatever? Actually, specifically, he says American Girls are better than yours. Um... Which is funny to me, because, like, in my head, I know, like, me aside, like, no one outside of America even knows who, like, Counting Crows are. That's not actually true, they're, like, decently, I think they're relatively popular. Uh, but it's funny, because Counting Crows are, like, the, like such an American band. I know they're, like, not quite country, but, like, they're, like, pr like they're pretty close a lot of the time, I'd suggest. 
very like like very 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 American and didn't have a lot of um well actually no I think it'd be unfair to say accidentally in love probably slap but that's probably just because Shrek slap you know um so I don't know who 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 they're like targeting when they say better than yours as like the most American band of all time where like 99% of their audience is American um but you know it's probably just like American braggadocity. That was another thing that made me laugh, was watching the opening ceremony and uh, 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 Team USA being the only country on the entire fucking planet who chanted over the um, Olympic uh, orchestra. The only country, and I watched the entire thing, every single country on the planet respected the Olympic anthem. And then USA came out and were like, USA, USA. I'm like, oh, you can't, like, I know that this is why, you know, like, I, I, can't, I can't say this because I don't, because of how I am with America, but, like, you know when people say that, like, like the rest of the world, like, hates America? <laughs> and then Americans are like, why? You know. Anyway, I thought it was funny, though. I, I got a good chuckle out of it. Um, and then I also drew North Korea. And then I also drew... Bhutan and then wrote Bhutan in Bhutanese uh, and I was you know all of my family drew a bunch of flags and we had like 20 something flags in total uh, I drew Bhutan and I drew the dragon and it looked really bad although in my defense no offense to to Bhutan I don't like the dragon is a little bit messy on the flag anyway is that offensive it's cool I'm rocking with it or I wouldn't have drawn it I like the dragon like I drew it out of respect for the dragon you know what I mean and if anything, like, I'm from the UK, I would go as far as to say that the Bhutan dragon is better than the the Wales dragon. Actually, to be fair, look, I don't like, I, I actually don't mind the Wales dragon, it's pretty cool. I prefer the Bhutan dragon, though, um, and I drew it. Uh, now, what would be offensive is if I showed the flag, because I did a bad job. That would probably, like... I'm a bad drawer. Actually, you know what? It looks alright. I do, I do have pictures of it. It looks alright. Um, yes, yeah, so I've been watching some of that. Um, they have skateboard in this here. They have three on three basketball. They have five on five basketball, which obviously I've been watching because of um, you know Team USA as has uh, Drew Holiday and Chris Middleton, uh, NBA World Champions. Um, but then it's funny because it's it's FIBA rules, uh, which is like not at all. Did that in the wrong order. Did that in totally the wrong order, and I'm stupid. But Abaddon has saved me, so who cares? I I it's FIBA rules, and the NBA aren't used to it. But then it's funny because a lot of the, like European players, um, <laughs> Dame was like, oh, why is. <laughs> Like, it's, it's weird, a lot of the, like, uh, European NBA players, like, play so much harder for their country. And then, there's, there was, like, a picture of him, um... Oh, who was it again? Who was it again? Was it... Was it... Who, who, who did they, who did they play... Who did Team USA play, like, two days ago? But there was a picture of Dame, I can't remember who he was looking at, like, because it, cause it was, it was, it was showing Dame's face. Um, but he was looking at someone... And the fr they didn't play for no, who's, who's why can't I even remember who's in Team USA's group? Australia, right? Because Australia beat them. Oh, was it join Australia? Okay, man, who cares? Uh, and he was just looking at him like, I, I I never seen you do this before. It was kind of funny because the Team USA team is basically like an NBA All Stars team, <laughs> and yet they they uh, they're struggling a little bit. Um, however, um, uh, you know. Drew and Chris are there, so I'm watching that. And I'm watching the football, even though uh, Team GB doesn't have... You know, our women's our women's team has, has gone, so I've been watching the women's football. Uh, we played Canada today and drew 1-1. But the, the men's team, they couldn't get along for long enough to organise putting a team together, so they just aren't taking part in the Olympics. Which is annoying, because we our prospective team would have been really fucking good. Um, because in in football in the Olympics, uh, there's an age cap of of 23. Uh, it's a 23 man squad, so you take 23 players with you. Um, you're allowed two uh, overage players, so so two of the 23 man squad can be like whatever age, right? And then the other 21 players have to be 23, age 23 or under. 
uh, England's team is really young right now. We have a lot of super young players. Um, which is why, you know, after the Euros, people are like, oh, you know, we've got a bright future and stuff. It's because we do have, we were like one of the youngest squads in the Euros. So we would have had a really good Olympic team. Um, but England and Scotland and Wales just hate each other and couldn't just agree to just have a team. So we just don't have one. Um, so that's pretty sick. Careful. Um, but yeah, you know, I'm rocking with uh, um, just about. Is there still is that there's archery in the Olympics in this Olympics, right? Still, I, I feel like I haven't I haven't checked. I mean, need to check. I haven't. But if there is, I'll definitely be watching the archery because I I love archery. So that's cool. Um, but you know, I'm 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 down with the Olympics. Team GB had like a bit of a slow start, and then we had we got five medals yesterday. So that that's that's fun. Um, so it's nice to root for some underdogs, and we were doing. It was unfortunate because like we we were, we could have done better, but we kept missing them from like, like like an like an underdog would 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 win, and that'd be why we wouldn't get one. And it's like oh well, you know at least an underdog's winning. Like um, uh, Kosovo won won a medal at one point, and I think that was in something that we were. I was in boxing, right? And I think we were expected to get a medal in that, and then didn't. But it was like hey, Kosovo got a medal there. That's cool. Um, and you know, J uh, Jade Jones was 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 like favorite to at the very least get a medal, but was like favorite for the gold. And then she went out in the first round. So you know, it was a little unfortunate, but you know, picking up picking up steam. We usually we usually in the top ten. Yeah, so we'll see what happens with that. You know, dude, I like the Olympics. I'm curious to know what everyone's favorites are. I always end up watching like like cycling and um, like swimming and stuff, even though they're not necessarily my favorites. I kind of always like end up watching them. Um, like I'll just watch whatever's on. Obviously it's hard right now because it's in Japan, so like time zone wise. Well, I guess sleep schedule wise, I could probably. Okay, we'll take Gubby. I'll be Gubby, sure. I guess it probably doesn't make a difference to me. Is there archery? It's got it. There's archery, right? Yeah. I didn't do the second secret room. Um, Twitter notification. Twitter notification. That is not so livid. Like my Twitter tweet. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. I do appreciate it because I like that tweet. I thought that was funny. Um, Olympics. 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 Archery. Is there archery? 2021. Archery distance. I like the idea that it's just how far can you shoot arrow. Ah, South Korea. There's been three, and South Korea won gold in all three. Archery. Pittman. It was today! They did some today, and I missed it! Yo, Pittman. We have a, we have a lady in archery, and she won... She beat Mexico. Oh, she, okay, so she's in... So what is this? What am I looking at? 5.24am tomorrow. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna watch that. She won. She beat. What even is that? The f is that ROC? Is that Russia? Um, she beat someone in the round of 32, and then beat Mexico, a Mexican lady, in the round of 16. So we've got a lady in the quarters of women's individual archery, and then uh, we have a bloke lost to a. Uh, um, uh, to Bangladesh in the round of 32 yesterday, and then we have another guy in another round of 32 individual tomorrow at 5:24, and then we have another guy who made it to the quarter and lost. Yo, I've been missing hella. It's to pay. I've been missing hella archery. Okay, 5:24 a.m. I will be watching that one tomorrow. P. Huston versus M. Dalmeida, and then. We have... I want to know when Pittman plays, because she looks like she's crushing it right now. Yeah, I really like archery. I like archery a lot. I like archery. Big fan of archery. Love archery. Um, So that's exciting. I need to just, like, look at the, like, full-on schedule and have a bit of a, a scroll through. See what I'm... See what's going on. Because I, um, I want to watch more. There's, like, 11 days left still. The Winter Olympics are my favorite. I'm, I'm a Winter Olympics boy, for sure. But dude, I'm, I'm you know, I enjoy the Olympics. It's good, you know, every four years. 
good, it's a good time, I think. It's a good time, I think. That's my uh, QOTD. Speaking of Pokemon series, you know when people do Pokemon series and then they would say on screen QOTD? That's my QOTD. What, what, what are your guys' favorite Olympic sports? Oh! Okay, thank you, flies. I thought the room was finished. <laughs> um, These Isaac ones go on for a while, huh? Like, these Isaac runs be long. <laughs> They'd be a little bit long. Do I have no bits saved up? Like, anywhere? Okay, stupid. Silly. Stupid and dumb and silly. Um, um, no, I think. I think no to that one. Let me check my Samsung notes. Do I have anything saved up? I only have, like, 20 more minutes. So, um, um, I don't, um, Um, oh, I do have, uh, I don't know if I can be bothered with that one. And then this one, I don't, this one doesn't, I don't know what I was going for for this one. It just says, location, movie, the reason I'm a furry, question mark. That sounds like a great bit. What was I thinking when I wrote that? What the hell is location movie? Location movie, the reason I'm a furry, question mark. That sounds like a, a dynamite bit. Oh, I'm disappointed I forgot wherever I was wherever I was going with that one. <laughs> location that's gotta be a typo. What the hell is location movie? Location movie. The reason I'm a furry. Have I watched any movies? I imagine the punchline there was me, I was gonna like I had like a bit there was like some movie and I was gonna talk about it and then I was gonna be like uh it, anyway, so that's the reason why I'm a furry. And the, like that would be the punch. Obviously, I'd deliver it a little bit better than that, but then that would be like the punchline because I'm I'm not one of those. But then it'd be funny, right? But it's almost funnier that I don't at all remember where I was going with that, and it just says the reason I'm a furry question mark location movie. That's, I'm sure that's a typo. I'm sure it's like it was called something else. Damn, it's killing me. But that's funny. There you go. Funny bit. I want to do a video at some point in the main channel. Yo, I have tons of video ideas from the main channel all of a sudden. I have this Roblox video that has been waiting to be edited for about two weeks. I got hit today. I, I only had like three hours of sleep last night. I went to bed exhausted at like 6 a.m. And then was still awake until 8 a.m. And then finally fell asleep, even though I was super tired. And then woke up at like 11.50. It was like, what the hell, dude? <laughs> what you, like, why? What are you doing? Just like be asleep for longer. I don't get it. <laughs> What's the problem? Um, so I'll probably have a nap later, to be honest. But, fucker, fucker, little fucker, little tiny. Um, I could edit that later, but I want to put the Roblox one up, but I had another idea for a video. I want to do a video somewhere where I go through my Twitter drafts, because I, I, I said before, I save so much to the drafts, so I think it'd be funny. Like, like when, if I save something to a draft and then I'm like, I go to tweet it a little later, um, I, I like to scroll, to, if I open my drafts, to scroll down to the bottom to where the most recent draft is, takes like a minute. Of scroll like okay maybe I'm exaggerating but it takes like it ta like 30 seconds like I have to scroll past like hundreds of tweets from like the past however many years there's got to be some gold in there that'd be funny to just read back through um so I think I'm gonna that could be a fun video at some point I think it's too late for bookworm and uh, what floor are we on cathedral yeah let's just let's just survivability in it I said I was going to talk about my weekend, and I just didn't do that at all. Oops. Oopsie, oopsie. Okay, just... Okay, you missed it, you missed it, you missed it, is the thing. Why am I so very good with my notes? Are there any other good bits in there? Oh, good. One shop item for free. I'm, uh, I mean, like, it doesn't matter at all. Olivia Rodrigo bit. But you need to be more specific with these notes. Umpire bit. Fuck's sake, man. <laughs> I'm usually more specific. I guess these were all just ones that I maybe came up with all at one go. What was the Olivia Rodrigo bit? S something about... I remember I have a tweet in the drafts that I didn't tweet because I couldn't think of a way to phrase it in like a funny way. Like it was too wordy. Um, 
so I, I didn't sweet it in the end, and now I think good for you has, has passed a little bit, so that one probably won't make it. But that bit was something like, um, uh, okay, let me, okay. So like, uh, so the bit would, so I'd go like, hey, hey, you guys, you guys heard um, Good For You recently? You know that new song, Olivia, breakup song by Olivia, Olivia Rodrigo? First of all, did you guys fucking know the, like, the dude who, you know, the girl who's like, oh, you're with someone new now? Like, Olivia Rodrigo's like, oh, good to see you're happy with someone new. Do you know who the someone new is? Fucking Sabrina Carpenter? Did you guys know that? It's Sabrina Carpenter. So, look, I'm, look, I'd be happy to. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> That's all I'm fucking saying. Um, anyway, what's up? I forgot what I was saying. I just want to focus here because we can't get hit. Forgot what I was saying again. So it was going to be like, oh, like what's... The, oh, okay, so I was going to go, okay. So, hey, good for you. I, I think that's like up there now with my top... Three. What's up? Oh. How, how does this game work? <laughs> what did I... Do I not? So I had the... I, I know I had the negative, but then... Does that even count as a win? Oh, it does. Dude, easy wins! Just take the negative and kill Isaac! How do I get to neck? How do I get down? Do you go down? Oh, is it mom's heart? Is it after mom's heart you're supposed to go down? I have no idea, man. Um, you know what? For the best, because I don't know where I was going with that Olivia Rodrigo bit. Oh, the joke was going to be I add it to. I'm going to add it to the the top to the list of the best breakup songs with um, "Black" by Pearl Jam and "Snuff" by Slipknot. I think it fit right in. Haha. <laughs> And then that would be the joke, because it's funny because it's a breakup song and they're both breakup songs, but then one is like, I know someday you'll have a beautiful life. Like, they're both like really emotional, like, you know, gut wrenching. You know, you get it. And then Good For You is like a catchy pop. Just, you know, you get anyway, the run's done, the run's done. Thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna go. Eh, Skyrim could go up today, but then I don't remember what it talks about in it, so maybe that should go up today and Isaac can go up tomorrow, but I feel like recency bias, I want to upload this like right now. So I guess Skyrim can go up tomorrow, and so if I talk about anything that's like timely, then just remember that Skyrim episode was from like Friday. So I should probably upload that first, but fuck it, right, dude. I might play Gungeon, um, maybe, so at some point, but who knows. Um, okay, goodbye. Bug! Have I turned my hockey off? Why isn't my hockey work anymore?